Being here at the Cheltenham Science Festival is a great opportunity for Philips to bring some cutting edge technology to the general public and in doing so give them an insight into how technology plays a part in the health environment and well-being environment going forward. Today we are being increasingly encouraged to play a part in our own health. The educated patient is something that's opined by everyone in healthcare and giving public the chance to look at what they can do in taking ownership in this area can only benefit both the practitioners and the patient themselves. This technology being developed by Philips Healthcare and we work in partnership with Philips to deliver the very best in diagnostics. We're here in Cheltenham supporting uh, Cobalt Imaging, who are a leading medical imaging company. They're based here in Cheltenham. We will be supporting their activity of beaming live MRI scanning of the brain, see how the brain works functionally, rather than just seeing an anatomical map. This is the second time that Cobalt has participated in the Cheltenham Science Festival. And it's great that we can show how science and technology can aid medical diagnosis. And this technology is changing at such a rapid pace, particularly in MRI. And using the Philips MRI scanners, we can show the public, who are particularly interested in healthcare, how we can aid that diagnosis. We have a vital signs camera application, which allows people with smartphones, iPads, to be able to get some awareness of their breathing, and heart rates for different situations. Secondly, we have something called a kitten scanner. And the kitten scanner is a method of relaxing patients, specifically pediatric patients, young children, who are about to go for a scan. And it's quite remarkable how, when you involve patients prior to the scanning, how relaxed they are when they actually have the scan. And lastly, but by no means least, we have our heart start defibrillator, which shows you don't have to be a doctor to save a life. Oh, I had the, um, the pulse and the breathing exercise done. Uh, really easy, really simple. I'm probably not surprised they're involved in healthcare, but I thought that the lady was just explaining that an app that anyone can download can read your heart rate, temperature and all those sorts of things just by looking at you through a camera. Seems pretty impressive. So anyone in the home could have this and you know, monitor the heart rate, monitor the health effectively. So I was pretty impressed by that. But I thought it's, it's really interesting to find out what's going on in the technology area. And uh, she explained some of the uses of it with like older people and more fragile skins and so, so it's, I was very impressed. By using a camera they can tell what your um, um, pulse rate is and also what your respiration rate is. The uh, blood flow creates like a, a, a small impulse as it goes around the body and it causes a blush on the skin and the, the camera is measuring that as well. So it's, it's really interesting, really, really interesting. They also had a, um, a model um, MRI scanner which they were putting toys in to try and encourage young children not to be frightened about MRI scanners. So lots of interesting things there. Certainly it was some of the stuff that Philips had on display I was not aware that they produced and certainly I think something which they obviously were demonstrating which I think is of great interest. They were um, non-invasive you know scanning, um, they even had I think sort of versions that children could use as well um, which is all part of I guess like dentists have been trying to do for years is breaking down people's anxiety, people getting familiar with things, um, comfort factor, so that's certainly, to come along and see things like that which they've got sort of out there I think is quite interesting and again it's, it's developments for the future so yeah.